Good morning, everyone. My name is Kim Carlisle. And I'm Sarah Carlisle. And we have a shop full of Heise glassware. We're located just north of Indianapolis, Indiana. And our shop is open at this time by appointment only. So please get a pencil and paper ready. We're going to show you our email address in a minute. This morning's video is another edition of Half Price Thursday. Half Price Thursday, where we pull items out of the shop for storage. And we put them on a table outside this room, and everything will be sold for one half the price that's marked on it. So if you're ready, we're going to show you our email address. Again, my name is Kim Carlisle. And I'm Sarah Carlisle. And the email address is the letter K C A R L I S L at A T T dot N E T. And there is no E on the end of Carlisle on that email address. I'm going to give you a quick little preview of our shop. We have 18 cases and 9 tables, chock full of Heise glassware. We do buy Heise, one piece or an entire collection. So if you know someone that has any Heise for sale, please have them get in contact with us and maybe we can buy it. For this morning's video, we can combine several weeks of videos so we're not sending you maybe a box with just a salt cellar in it. We can put several pieces in that box before you ship it. we ship it to you. So if you're ready, Sarah and I are going to back out of this room and we're going to give you a preview of what is on the table this morning. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to another edition of Half Price Thursday. And we'll give you a quick little preview of what we have on the table today. If you see anything you're interested in, you can call, text, or email. If you don't have our phone number, all you have to do is send us an email. We'll send you our phone number. Then you can start calling and texting us. Just remember that calls and texts do come in quicker than emails do. We can combine several weeks of videos, so we're not shipping you a box with maybe just one little nut cup in it. We can combine several weeks of videos until we've got a box pretty well full for you. So if you're ready, let's get started. Sarah, what's the first item? First item we have today is a Revere, I believe it's a three pound candy jar with a floral decoration on it. It's $85. Another Revere candy jar. This is probably just probably a pound or maybe a two pound candy. Has a nice little intaglio cutting on it. And the price is $35. Same cutting as the three pound. And when we mention the price, like that one's $35, it's half price Thursday, so you're gonna get that for $17.50. We have a squatted little syrup that's marked on the bottom that has patent april 5th 1910 with the large diamond h clean on the inside 35 dollars circle pair of soda glass probably 10 or 12 ounces we have five of them available and they're 35 dollars a piece we have a rooster head cocktail i believe we have two of them available and they're 25 dollars a piece here's a flat panel creamer and sugar has a nice little cutting on them. Uh, there's a little problem. What's the problem with these, Sarah? Underneath the handle on the sugar bowl, there is a couple little small chips on it. And they're $15 for the pair. Next, we have four. Seven and a half inch plates for $15. And they're marked in the center of the bottom. Crystallite six inch oblong ashtray. This is a hard one to find. It does have just a slight, slight sun color to it. It's $20. We have a flamingo demi tasse with four of them available and they're $8 a piece. Crystallite footed cigarette holder, $10. Prince of Wales Hotel Creamer. The handle is, does have a crack. There is some wear on the pattern. Six dollars. Pin charter flamingo goblet. It has the same stem on it as the Jamestown. That's a Jamestown stem, but they put a different shaped bowl on it. This one has that little narrow optic and it flares out at the top, which is what makes it that pattern. It's thirty dollars. About eight and a half inch pineapple and fan vase clean on the inside. Thirty dollars. Barbara Fritchie Brandy. This is a brandy because the bowl holds less ounces than the cordial. $45. Here we have an Ipswich large candy jar bottom. You can put this at the head of the table and this can be the banquet goblet for the guy at the end. $20. It looks just like a goblet, it's just a larger size. Polo player soda glass. We have three of these available and they're about Four and a half inches tall. For $40 a piece. 
coal port cigarette jar. Tough iron to find. We had one of these a couple weeks ago. This one, $25. Queen Anne dolphin footed candle holder. One available and it's $12.50. Here we have an octagon celery tray. It looks like it's in Hawthorne. Could be sun purple, I'm not sure. Anyway, it makes a nice combination with the octagon creamer and sugar and Sahara. Uh, the tray is $20 and the creamer and sugar is $30. And if you want the set, we're gonna say the set for, how much do we say, Sarah? It would be 20. 25. 20? We'll sell you, we'll say the set for $20 if you want it. Creamer and sugar and the tray. Richly. One-handled jelly, $25. Here's originally small cigarette, oh, I'm sorry, this is a small cigar ashtray, and it's $15. Then we have the larger Ridgely cigar ashtray, and it's also $15, no damage on those. We have the square and the round cigarette holders, and they're $8 a piece. Lariat two light candle holder, has a nice little floral cutting on the bottom of it, and it's twelve dollars and fifty cents, and we only have one available. Pinwheel and fan pitcher. There is some damage on the pattern. There's some chips on it. Lots of wear on the bottom, but it's only twenty-five dollars. Handles in good condition. Here we have an old Williamsburg two light candelabra. If you look at the boba shades, those are flat. May not be Heisey, may be Heisey, I don't know. Anyway, you're buying this set as it is. Prisms have some damage on the bottoms of the point. Uh, anyway, you got two nice sockets here. No problem at all with those. It's $50 for it. $25 at the discount. Each socket's worth $25. Queen and dolphin footed floral bowl. Good condition feeder all, good, no damage, $15. To go with it, we have a mint dish. Also Queen Anne with the nice flower cutting on it. It's $5. Have two octagon nut cups. We have a moon flame and we have a flamingo. And the what's the price on these, Sarah? $15 a piece. 15 each. Priscilla. Nut. Nut. $12.50. We have three salt sellers. The first one's Revere. It is plain. It is $6. We have a narrow flute. It is $5, then we have a Revere that has a cutting on it, and it's $10. We have a Priscilla Butter Pat, one available, $10. Next, we have a Lariat Cigarette and Ash, a cigarette holder and ash tray, and it's $8 with two available. That's $8 a piece. Phyllis Creamer and Sugar. The Sugar Bowl does have a small bruise on the handle Right there. For the pair, it is six dollars. Six dollars for the pair. Both of them have wear. Here's a little ashtray. Of course, we're not very good at looking up ashtrays. Funny little pattern. Does have a little nick on one of those little loops someplace. Fifteen dollars. Saturn Cruet clean on the inside stopper has a flake on it. Thirty dollars. Hmm. I'm going, to, I'm going to guess this is a King Arthur stem on it, handled, footed, iced tea. The top has definitely been repaired, even though there's a flare on it. Some of that flare has been taken off, and it's $8. Plain band butter. I don't believe there's any damage on this. Not yet, anyway. $40. Old sandwich footed comport, $35. have two horseradish jars. One of them is marked, one of, and both of them have a little bit of damage inside the top, either on the stopper or inside that edge. One of them's marked, one of them's not marked. Anyway, they're $10 a piece for your choice. And they're both a little bit different shape. Here we have a colonial piece. We're not sure if this is a short straw jar, maybe it's a spooner, maybe it's a sugar. Anyway, 15 bucks, good condition. What was that, 508? 508 soda, you don't see these very often. They did make them in that early rose or flamingo color, marked in the center of the bottom, and it's $10, one available. We have a wood duck, mother wood duck. It does not fluoresce under a black light. The bottom has been polished down and grounded. It's good, There's, it's really good quality. 
but, and it's marked, but it just doesn't flush yellow under a black light, $165. And it's the Motherwood Duck. Oval, crystal light, cigarette holder, $15. Flamingo. Yeoman, I believe. Ashtray. Lots of wear on it. Ten dollars. Twist. Cream ah, twist creamer. It's a twist candle holder. There's a pair of them. Each one of them is marked at the top of the column underneath it, and they're forty-five dollars for the pair. Master Swan Nut Dish. Fifteen dollars, and we have four baby nut cups in the signets, five dollars a piece. Diamond Point individual marmalade and underplate. How much are we selling both of them for, Sarah? Uh, um, oh, 1200 Oh, how about that? $8 for the pair. Old Sandwich Butter Pats. We have six available, and they're $5 a piece. We have Sahara Old Sandwich Butter Pats as well, and I believe we also have six of these. And they're twenty-five dollars a piece. This is a large Waverly or Fern four-part relish, orchid etching on it, and it's thirty-five dollars. Waverly footed jelly orchid etch, fifteen dollars. Waverly oval footed nut bowl orchid etch, forty-five dollars. Puritan Fruited Jelly, $8. I'm going to roll. Peerless. This is either a flared uh, sherbet or it's also in the book they call a violet vase. How much was the price, Sarah? $8. Take it. Go for it. Fancy Loop Water Bottle. There is slight roughness to the pattern in different areas. $75. Very slight roughness. Pinwell and Fan variant basket. This is one of those items that Heise did not own the mold of this. Another company owned the mold and they leased the mold off of Heise. That is, every time they poured a basket, they paid that company so much money for it. It's $125. It is marked in the center of the bottom. That concludes our video for today of Half Price Thursday. Please join us and listen up. We're going to have a video next Monday, and that's going to be new additions to the shop. So everybody have a great weekend, and we'll see you bright and early Monday morning at 8 o'clock for new additions. Thank you, and goodbye.